Okay, so uh, using Pod Manager, uh, we are going to uh, compose a purpose few set of nodes uh, that can be used for a specific workload. So I can come in and say, I want five servers that have at least uh, 20 cores and 256 gig of memory. Um, so if I had enter here, uh, it's going to find me those servers and I'm going to list what it found. It found five servers for me uh, that have at least 256 gig of memory and, and 20 cores. And mass, you can see mass here. Uh, it automatically detected those nodes and added that and uh, now we got the five servers into mass and they're starting to commission. So automatically coming from like bare metal hardware uh, that uh, just came into the data center, I requested those few uh, five servers and automatically showed up in uh, uh, MAS and started commissioning. Uh, the information that MAS needs, uh, for example, the uh, credentials for uh, the BMC, they're being discovered through uh, Redfish from, uh, uh, from our rack. So uh, everything it needs, that's why you see that green uh, uh, it's saying that uh, it knows how to control the power uh, of the server. So, uh, in about uh, you know ten minutes, this uh, this they will go into uh, ready state, uh, ready state, and we will be able to deploy OpenStack. In this case, we have three servers that are already in the ready state, and I have uh, a Juju environment running uh, a landscape uh, with autopilot, and I can come in here and deploy a full uh, OpenStack cluster. So I can uh, pick my hypervisor, set up my networking, select uh, Ceph for object store, Ceph for block, Nagios for monitoring, and I'm ready to add my nodes and deploy OpenStack. and uh, it's going to start deploying OpenStack. So uh, you saw the uh, simple process from uh, uh, using Pod Manager as uh, this uh, central repository of uh, uh, all the resources in the rack and, and being able to uh, carve out a, a set of servers for a specific need and bring those servers automatically into mass and uh, start commissioning and going to uh, the stage of deployment of OpenStack.